I literally tastes like if vodka was jelly. That is really strong. <laughs> it's nearly 50-50. Jingle bell Happy Vlogmas everyone. If you can hear that noise in the background, it's actually May running towards me because she wants dinner. But you know what? I'm hungry too and we've got some snacks to make for tomorrow. So that's what we've got to do first. The noise I was actually referring to is my kettle boiling because right now we are making jelly shots. So I'm making some Christmas themed jelly shots. I found a cool photo on Pinterest, so I'm using that as kind of my inspo. They were fireball jelly shots, but you girl just wants some basic vodka ones um, because I know that like, you know, you only need a small amount of the alcohol for these recipes. And I don't really, I've never had fireball sober enough to remember what it tastes like. I like cinnamon, so I'm sure I'd actually probably really like it. But I thought I'd go nice basic vodka, then I've got extra vodka to drink because I drink vodka sodas. Um, so we're making green and red jelly shots. The photos have this cool whipped cream and some garnishing on top. So I'm going to prep the jelly shots tonight and I'll finish off one to show you what it looks like as well and then I'll insert at the end like the next day because I don't want the whipped cream to go like soggy on top overnight so I'll do that just before everyone gets here um but yeah I'm really excited so the kettle's boiled I didn't know how much I would need um I wasn't sure what cups to get either because I thought the shot glasses might be a little like I couldn't find clear shot glasses and obviously I want to do red and green so I found these cups like this so they're bigger obviously bigger than a shot glass and then I just got some little spoons and I thought especially with the whipped cream on top then they can just eat them and that will be so much easier so we're gonna give that a go I don't know how much I'm gonna um, use I'm hoping to fill these a third to a half full with green jelly leave them be let them set and then come back and do the same with the red jelly this is strawberry not raspberry um, so yeah obviously I need to do this in two parts so that the green has time to set before I put the red on top otherwise they'll mix together too much so I'm gonna do that we'll take a break I'm gonna do another cooking video um, which will have already been up but that'll be my my Jack Daniels chocolate fudge things I don't know how they're gonna go I've already been eating the chocolate that I need to for that recipe as well so uh, I don't know at least I haven't been drinking the alcohol yet also disclaimer drink responsibly blah 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 this isn't aimed at children this is just me cooking and this is just what I happen to be cooking so yeah also my kitchen is like the worst kitchen ever like welcome to all of my bench space like Fuck this. Alright, so we're gonna do green first. Oh, I didn't get spray! I didn't get spray! It works best if you spray these first, but usually if I'm doing jelly shots, you know you're gonna like lick it out of the cup. Um, these, since they're bigger and I'm giving them a spoon, they actually shouldn't need to be sprayed. I take that back. That should actually be okay. But if you're doing them in shot glasses, give them a little spray with some cooking oil. Just a really light one, just so that it comes out more easily. So, what are the instructions for this? Oh my god, here it is. It's not on the back, it's on the side of the packet. Wow, I'm, I'm a dickhead. Um, Alright, so we need one cup of boiling water and 200 mils of cold water. So that's to make it normally. So that is 450 mils of water total or fluid total. So 450 divided by 2 is 225. So what we're going to do is we're going to round up. We're going to do 250 mils of boiling water and we're going to get it to dissolve and then add our vodka. Move please. I find this dissolves best as well when you mix in the jelly crystals just a little bit at a time rather than dump them all in. May, I swear to God, you cannot have this. Also, if you're mixing it in a clear um, or glass jar like I am, I put in 250 mils and as I'm mixing it, it's increasing it. So keep that in mind. You want a separate measuring cup to measure your vodka or alcoholic beverage. I'm lifting it up to see on the bottom 
if all of the jelly crystals have dissolved, which they have not yet. Um, May, can you get down, please? Jelly shots are not for puppies. They're for adults. I actually should have measured my vodka first in here and then put it into a cup to the side because I don't have other measuring cups. Oh, Jesus. How do I... All right, so this is 225 mils. So if I underfill this slightly, it should be all fine. Okay, all right, and we... Oh, wow. May out of the liquor cabinet. No, my mum will kill me if I do that. Eh, haha! -ha. Oh my god, that actually worked. Hell yeah. All right, so we underfill slightly with the vodka. Now. We want to make sure that this isn't too hot because otherwise the alcohol will just evaporate off. So I'm going to give this another stir and then I'm going to actually just run the outside of the glass under the cold tap just to cool it down a little bit more. Now the best bit, add the vodka. Hell's yeah. I don't know how many this is going to fill up. Let's start with this and see. Ooh, the vodka smells good. All right, this might be a good amount. And then I've got double the red jelly, so I can always just make some more, um, I can make some more just straight up red ones as well. So I've got an extra one. Oh! yes and I actually love it because these ones come with the little lids so that means I can put the lids on and I can actually stack them in the fridge so I can store more than what I usually would be able to all right I'm gonna go put these in the fridge and then I will see you guys um, in I don't know maybe like an hour when they start to set they don't need to set fully just enough that we can do the exact same thing may stop with the collar on the bowl um, yeah just enough so that you know we can put the red ones on top without them completely mixing together okay it's been a million years it's starting to get really late the jelly isn't set set but it's set enough that you can touch it a little bit on the top so they might have a little ombre blend in the middle but it should be all good so I've measured out 200 mils of vodka in my measuring cup properly this time. Um, now it's 250, 250, 240. I actually think my mum used to make this recipe half um, in thirds. And I think last time I made it, I made it in thirds as well. Like a third boiling water, a third cold water, and then a third vodka. Whereas this I'm doing nearly 50-50. There's less vodka. Um, too, too much vodka and it won't set. So let's hope this works. Even if it doesn't, they'll still taste good. Oh, you can probably hear my washing machine now too. Since I had to wait so long for the green jelly to set, I started like um, you know, like setting up my stuff for tomorrow for when people come over so I've got less to do in the morning. I decided that since I made so much fudge between the green layer of jelly and the red layer of jelly, like the Jack Daniels fudge, that I wouldn't make up the two packets of um, red jelly. I'll just top off the ones that are in there because I'm also going to make jam donut shots, um, Bailey's and Chambord. So I don't want to like give my friends alcohol poisoning. We just want it so it's not steaming because if it's steaming then that's when you know the alcohol will evaporate. Alright, let's give this a good little mix up. And then this should nicely top off all of the green ones that I've already got going on in the fridge. I'm hoping that this works. I probably should have just got out one first to see how this goes. Because I don't want them to mix completely straight away, obviously. Let's have a look. Oh, okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. You can see where I poured it in at the start. It kind of like went through a little bit here. Um, but I think I know how to avoid that. The same way I lay up my 
um, Chambord and Bailey's Shots. That worked much better. There's a little bit of red on the bottom. But that's mostly 50-50. You can see, yeah, like a little bit of red on the bottom, but I think that that should actually be completely fine. I'm pretty, I'm, I'm pleased with myself. This outcome is not too bad. It's getting too late for me to wait for the green to set anymore. It's like 11.30 at night. I've still got to obviously have a shower. I still have to try the fudge and make sure that's okay because that's been in the fridge surely long enough by now. So I really hope they set. Um, I guess we'll just have to see in the morning how they go. So there we go. Christmas jelly shots sitting in there. Fingers crossed they all turn out well tomorrow. Okay, so the little jelly shots turned out really, really well. And they seem to have set too, which is amazing. It might be a bit mushy when you actually take it, but they aren't liquid. So I'm very happy. Love the red and green layering. Now this is the extra step. I'm only gonna do it on one because I want to I'm not gonna do it on all of them, I'm just gonna do it on a few in case some people don't want whipped cream. Then I've just got these sprinkles. They are just like fun fetty sprinkles. So they're a mix of like little stars and circles and normal kind of sprinkles and stuff. So then we're just going to do a little sprinkle on the top of this. So it looks like a little Christmas treat. <laughs> Look how cute that is. I am so happy. I think I've done it so, so well. Oh my goodness, they're adorable. They are freaking adorable. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I enjoyed making these. I'm gonna enjoy eating them later as well. I'm gonna leave the whipped cream off a couple of them for myself though. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe and we'll see you in another video tomorrow. Bye guys. Jingle bell, 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 bell,